So yesterday I made a video talking about how much I miss my job and how much I miss having uh, social connections and the feeling of productivity and using my brain um, to do something productive because I've lost all of that now that I am at home on disability for my autoimmune disease. I didn't have a lot of energy yesterday and those thoughts of like longing and missing that aspect of my life um, really hit me emotionally and I was feeling quite down. So today as a way of trying to battle those difficult thoughts and trying to do something productive while still being disabled and in pain, I started to think about some of the projects that I have worked on up until this point while on disability. Um, the first one, which includes my children's book about autoimmune diseases. If you haven't seen the book, the title is called I'm the Biggest Helper with Mama's Autoimmune Disease, and it is available on Amazon and signed copies in my Etsy store. Um, it's an amazing, colorful children's book that teaches young kids about autoimmune diseases and gives examples of what young children can do to help somebody that might have an autoimmune disease. Um, they're all age appropriate things like getting themselves dressed and putting their shoes on or um, using the slide at the park or, you know, things like that. I worked on that project during my sickest days and almost all of the book was written and illustrated and manufactured. All of those conversations working with all of those different stakeholders was done from my own bed or with the help of my husband. It was a really amazing project and I felt great while I was doing it, like emotionally great while I was really sick and in pain. And so I'm kind of looking for what I can do now, what I can do next, something that can help me wake up and give me something to do as a distraction to the loneliness, isolation and pain that I deal with on a daily basis. I've been tossing around some ideas like I do have an Etsy store where I have some like apparel and stuff for chronic illness, Sjogren's and lupus. Um, I don't really actively sell uh, those things, but I think I'm going to start marketing them a little bit more. I thought about writing a book on Sjogren's or diving back into poetry or, um, you know, setting up a support group where we can actively just like log on, talk to each other and maybe work on some of these projects. So I guess what I'm doing is reaching out to you to ask you, would you be interested in this as somebody in the Spoonie or chronic illness community?